has been months since hundreds of Afghan refugees first arrived in Oklahoma. Since then, the number has more than doubled. News 9's Erica Lee has the update on how they're settling in and how nonprofits are working to get them what they need. There are currently approximately 540 Afghan refugees in the Oklahoma City metro area and 1,000 statewide. The executive director of CARE Oklahoma, Adam Sultani, tells me many are moving into permanent housing and enrolling in school. CARE Oklahoma and Catholic Charities have been working collaboratively to make sure our new neighbors feel welcome and settled. They've been reaching out to schools to make sure educators are aware of and are ready to help bridge cultural differences. Understanding the hijab, the headscarf that young Muslim women may wear to school or understanding that Muslims may request to take a prayer break at some point during the day. These simple things that can make their educational experience uh, that much better and more comfortable for them as they transition to a new life here in our state. When asked how the Afghan refugees are doing during the holiday season, Sultani says holidays such as Thanksgiving and Christmas are completely new to the refugees, but they have a big Muslim holiday that they're preparing for. The Eid holiday, which will be in May, right after the holy month of Ramadan, to where we can really have a big celebration once all the refugees have arrived, because that will be the first big holiday that will really resonate with them more than anything. Catholic Charities and Care Oklahoma are also preparing for the upcoming months and collecting donation items for winter. We haven't even hit that extreme winter weather here in Oklahoma. So things like winter coats, new gloves, new hats, um, scarves, blankets. Those are high need items right now. We are still expecting around 800 Afghan refugees to come into the state and CARE Oklahoma says there's a possibility that the state might be taking even more. Reporting in Oklahoma City, Erica Lee, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.